I'm Jim Wood, the mayor of Oceanside, California. Surfer Magazine 50 years means a lot, but it means even more to the city of Oceanside, Southern California, Surf Central, the place where we have the Surf Museum in California, it means a lot. What does 50 years of Surfer Magazine mean to me? Well, I, I discovered Surfer Magazine in 1988 uh, as a 16-year-old who had just moved to Carlsbad, California from New York City. And um, surfing was something very, very foreign to me. And uh, the first time I tried it, it instantly changed my life. And I said, I got to learn exactly what this thing is. And Surfer Magazine was that thing for me. I would go to the library at, at Carlsbad High School and pour through all the back issues of Surfer, going all the way back to like the mid 70s. And because of Surfer Magazine, I learned the history and I learned what I was a part of, that it was more than just this, this cool sport that I had discovered, but that I had really entered in, into a lifestyle and a brotherhood. And you know, Surfer Magazine has been there for me every month, loyally ever since. 50 years of Surfer Magazine means, I mean, the obvious answer is 50 years of stoke, of, of great photos, of great stories. Um, you know, early on it was about waiting for it to arrive in the mailbox and, um, you know, that energy, that, that, that magazine that would show up and just inspire you to go surfing and really, I mean, it's sort of cliche, but if anything, um, if there's anything that Surfer Magazine represents, it's that stoke to get you to go out in the water. What does 50 years of Surfer Magazine mean to me? Well, I think it means that uh, the magazine's been around a while, you know. It's got a lot of authenticity. It's, uh, you know, something that's iconic, something that is special. And to me, it's kind of neat because you only turn 50 once. You know, this, this, this night, this moment will never happen again. And it's something that we got to enjoy and cherish and soak in because once it's gone, you know, you, you don't have a 51st birthday party or 57. You know, 50 is kind of the big one. So. I'm looking forward to, to celebrating tonight and looking forward to 50 more years. So who knows what's next, you know? Well, we're here for 50 years of surfing. Can you believe that? It's been a, a long road that John Severson started the magazine that keeps us all inspired. So when I'm a Grom, you know, in Australia at Koolangatta, these are the kind of issues that influenced me because there was no internet in those days, right? It was the magazine. You know, and this is Jay Riddle at the ranch, and I wanted it style, and this was the lifestyle cover. Who'd have ever thought that I would end up on the cover? I think it was sometime in the 80s they called Surfer Magazine the Bible of the sport. I think it's way more than the Bible. The best thing about it is every 28 days we get our sacred text reinterpreted that we can use in our everyday life. And that really is what Surfer has been for me. I mean, starting in 1967, it was, month, it was a bi-monthly, but once it went monthly, every 28 days I got a new reaffirmation of my entire philosophy, my entire way of life. And I think that uh, that's what 50 years of Surfer mean to me, and I'm looking forward to the next 50 years. 50 years of Surfer magazine to me is kind of insignificant. I'm really focused more on two issues, the ones that I was on the cover of, 85 and 87. 50 years means to me is a whole lot more than I can actually think of. Well, I, I think there's a lot to be said for, a, a, you know, an enthusiast magazine that's lasted 50 years. Surfer Magazine, you know, in many ways, is, it's the father of this whole action sports industry. It's, it's the first one of the board sports and, you know, it paved the way for, uh, in a lot of ways, this entire lifestyle. So, it's a, it's a big thing and I think it's worth celebrating. 50 years is a long time for any business to... to to be thriving and um, you know surfers had its ups and downs and in this kind of economy everybody's sort of like just fighting for survival but I think surfers always going to be there no matter what. And, so uh, thanks for the 50 years uh, surfing magazine so there is nice cool stuff like picture all this stuff yeah thank you so much. I think it means 